it's time for another pony update. We've had beautiful sunshine up at the ranch this week. The ponies have found it quite hot, so they like to graze in the evenings when it's much cooler, and we've had beautiful sunsets up at the ranch. In the daytime, the ponies like to sleep underneath the trees in the shade, swishing the flies with their tails. The ponies are all missing you and are looking forward to seeing you when we all can again. This week, Lucy and Amy bring you a fun crafty game to play at home this week. We hope you enjoy it and we can't wait to see how you get on with it. It's Lucy and Amy. We love Shetland ponies and making craft. We are going to be making pony snakes and ladders. You will need board templates, you can find these on our website, card, sellotape, pony counters, these can also be found on our website, blue tack, coloured pencils but you could also use paint or card, and pony tails and jumps. To find the templates go to shetlandponyclub.co.uk Step one is to print out our templates and stick them together. If you don't have a printer, you could always draw this. I am taping the two halves of my board together with sellotape on the back. Once you've taped your board together, you can start colouring it in. I'm using coloured pencils, but you could of course use paint or any other art supplies that you have. I'm using a range of different colours to make the board stand out. Now it's time to add the snakes and ladders. For snakes we're using pony tails and for ladders we're using jumps. Make sure to spread these out all over the board. Once you are happy with your layout it's time to stick everything down. You can either use glue or use tape as I am. I have rolled my tape up with the sticky side facing out and stuck it to each one of my snakes or ladders. This gives them a 3D effect. Then place your game board to one side and gather your pony cutouts, blue tack and cart. Here we have Simba, Elgin Sunset, Creme Brulee and Sundance. Take your pony cutouts and draw these onto some cart, then cut them out and stick them to the back. Next, grab a piece of blue tack and push the bottom section of your pony counter into it. This will create a stand. Then grab some dice and you're ready to play. To play, each player places their counter at the start, then take turns to roll the dice and move that many spaces. If you land at the bottom of a jump, you can jump over it. However, if you land at the top of the tail, you have to go all the way down it. The person who wins is the first person to reach 100. I hope you enjoyed learning how to make pony snakes and ladders. Come back next time for more Shetland Pony Crafts. Thank you for watching Shetland Pony Club TV. There's a new episode every Wednesday. We have a new and exciting Shetland Pony Club online, a place where you can have lots of pony fun at home, full of craft, colouring in and quizzes. Thank you so much for watching and we'll catch you next week for a new episode.